In this lesson, we will learn to add the glossary to the course. The glossary activity can be used to create a glossary in the course. First click, turn edit and on. In the second week of the course, expand, add an activity drop down menu. And select glossary. Let's enter the glossary name as abbreviations and glossary. In the description box, enter. This is glossary for adding entries related to the course. Scroll down. And expand, glossary type drop down menu. Glossary are of two types, main glossary, and secondary glossary. Main glossary is unique in a course. But, there can be more than one secondary glossary in the course. Let's select main glossary. Leave, automatically link glossary entries to default yes, to allow automatically linking of the entries throughout the course. Then expand, approved by default drop down menu. And select no, to make, approval by teacher a must, before publishing the entries. Leave other settings as default and click, save and display. Click, add a new entry link. And then, enter the word or concept you want to add. For example, let's enter, evaporation, in the concept text box. And its definition as, turn from liquid into water. You can also enter similar words, that means as the same, in the keywords box. You can also attach an image or other supporting files for the entry. In auto linking area, check the box to allow auto linking of this entry. And click save changes. You can see the entry has been added. Now, open your Moodle site in your computer and implement the exercise before proceeding to the next video.